jump. Christ reveals living water, as in John 7, 37. In the last days of the great day of the feast, Jesus stood and cried and said, If any man is thirsty, let him come and with me and drink. He that believe on me and drink, as the scriptures have said, out of the belly shall flow rivers of flowing living water. Yes, God does call many to be filled up by his living water, just as Christ Jesus became, because he was made valuable and vulnerable. You have been you have been made, given this priceless gift, to be valuable and vulnerable. For you will be willing to be poured out, to be willing to give it all away. Being human with our defenses like DNA, instead wants it all, and then keeps it all. So many, like homes, are all overfilled and stuffed. Valuables but collecting dust. Memories attach clinging onto us, preventing any new ones or turn helping others. That's right. Do you, you gather stuff and all gathers dust because you got a memory attached to it and it doesn't do you any good. It sits in the corner and goes nowhere, right? He's calling us to be living water. We are to be filled and yet to be poured out so only fresh living water remains. This is a genuine moment of trust. Do you hold on to stuff you know you will not remain fresh because you're in fear nothing new is coming? Or do you take that first step, jump? I hate swimming. So at school, we were forced to take swimming classes. I don't know why school forces teenagers to be mixed company and wear clothes that don't fully cover to swim. But I went because it's required. Here's now the dilemma. Is if you don't like water, do you take those slow little steps into a pool or jump into the deep for it's either sink or swim? Well... I jumped in the deep. Living water is like this. I jump to be filled and to be fully poured out for others. Yes, it's to be vulnerable, knowing God, the creator of the universe, made you for this very moment. Don't be on the shelf like junk collecting dust. You are valuable. You're one of a kind with this living spring of water. It's in you. Yes, we're holding a part of God in you, so jump. It's 